Do you want the blue pill or the red pill? Or how about a green NEO coin? Let's enter the NEO matrix and have the truth about the NEO cryptocurrency explained. And be sure to hit those like and subscribe buttons and we'll keep the videos coming. NEO is an OG coin from 2014, formerly known as Ant Shares. It's been chugging along and is actually back in the news right now because of NEO 3.0 or NEO 3, a highly anticipated relaunch that aims to catapult the smart contract network to new heights. NEO is known as the Chinese Ethereum and brands itself as an open, decentralized network for the future smart economy. NEO 3.0 will make important upgrades to the protocol that will bring its smart economy vision to life. It aims to elevate the network with capabilities and an ecosystem similar to Ethereum, including smart contracts, full stack DeFi protocol called Flamingo Finance, decentralized file storage, a decentralized digital ID solution, a built-in Oracle and cross-chain interoperability via the Poly network. How will it do it? NEO3 will be an entirely new blockchain from the existing NEO mainnet generated from the Genesis block. Along with new features, NEO3 will also tout a brand new architecture and governance mechanism. Let's take a look at some highlights. NEO3 will feature its own decentralized storage network called NEOFS. Unlike other blockchains that rely on third-party storage providers like Amazon Web Services, NeoFS will actually enable users to have complete control over their data. Pulling this off would actually give Neo3 a substantial edge over other projects, as well as other siloed file storage projects like Filecoin and Sia. Next, Flamingo Finance on NEO, which has actually been ruffling the feathers in the cryptoverse by offering a full stack DeFi protocol on NEO's fast and feeless network. So users can swap, wrap and stake tokens while earning rewards. Also, while interacting across chains like Cosmos, Bitcoin, Ontology and Ethereum to work as a sort of workaround to escape congestion and high fees while tapping into the earnings potential of DeFi. It will also use a new asset standard for its tokens called NEP17, replacing the current NEP5. And what about governance? Well, NEO 3.0 will achieve consensus via a new dynamic and democratic on-chain governance mechanism, which includes the top 21 candidates voted in by NEO holders, with one NEO equaling one vote. Any registrar, informational organization, anonymous organization, or individual can become a candidate, seek votes, and join the NEO council. Out of these, only the top seven nodes will become consensus nodes of the network. The NEO Council is actually refreshed every 21 blocks for agility and flexibility. NEO is frequently compared to another popular blockchain project, VeChain, because they both have a unique dual token system. NEO tokens allow holders to vote for committee members and validated nodes that they trust. NEO is also an interest bearing token that generates another token called GAS. Neo coin holders generate gas automatically just by holding Neo. Rewarding me to hold no snakes in the grass when I stake for the gas. I sell my gas to buy more Neo, which I stake to buy more gas. Compounding my initial investment, I suggest to do the math. Gas has a lot of utility in the Neo ecosystem. For example, it is used to deploy smart contracts, fetching data from Neo's inbuilt Oracle, and uploading or downloading data from Neo's native file sharing layer. And gas fees are adjustable to reflect rises and falls in prices. Both NEO and GAS are capped at 100 million tokens, with the NEO coin currently having a circulating supply of 17 million and GAS 10 million. What is your NEO price prediction for 2021? Is NEO the one for you? Let us know in the comments below. And if this video helped you, then give it a like and a share and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.